Hi everybody, welcome to December Empties. Tell me what you think of this lighting. I have a lot of lighting behind you and I'm not sure if I need all of it. There is a slight glare in my glasses, but nothing too drastic. So I think it looks all right. Let me know what you think. Okay, empties are gonna be short and sweet since uh, I didn't think I'd have that much, but I have enough to post a video and it ups my year long total. So let's get started. We have the Garnier Fructis One Minute Mask in Papaya. This is my second purchase of it this year, $5.79. Ah, no buy. I'm on the no buy. You guys have seen that video. If you haven't, I'll have it linked down below. I want to finish at least one more of my hair treatment products before I can do just a pure moisture mask since I don't have, all I have are treatments, not just a deep conditioner. But soon I'll be able to rebuy one of these. And when I do, it's going to be the watermelon one. Next, I have the Blueberry Bliss. Oh, Curl Controlling Jelly. I wrote down the leave-in conditioner. I believe they're the same price, $17.99. I'll change it on the screen if the total or if the price is different, but I'm pretty sure it's the same. I forgot this was the gel. Um, there was like this much left, and I finally finished it off. $17.99, not something I will repurchase. It's just the texture is weird, didn't like it. The L'Oreal spray, you guys have seen this before. This was my last one. This is $9.99. Now I'm gonna try something that's more of a powder and you kind of shake it out. I'm not sure how I feel about it. I've only used it once so far, but uh, if I don't like that, I'm gonna go back to buying the packs of these at Costco. We've got an eye cream. This is my second one from Belief Beauty, $3. And we have another little sample. This is the Hourglass Veil, Hourglass Veil Mineral Primer. $3 is what I count my samples. Now, Teacher Loves Beauty had finished one of these and she calculated the total. I was gonna do that, but I don't really do that throughout the year. So, cause it's worth more if you calculate how much product is actually in here versus the full size. But because I haven't been doing that all year, I decided not to, so. $3. My total would have gone up too if I had done that. Uh, the ColourPop. I finished it. This is Adjust the Tint in the shade Always Right. Now this, I thought it was like a lip tint. It's a lip balm. Not really my thing, so I used it on the cheeks. And then for a little while I was, let's see if I can show you guys. I was digging it out. Hopefully it's focusing but I can't use it unless it's a brush, but I didn't like the product anyway. So this is gone and it was $6, will not be repurchasing. The AOA sponge, I'm using it for a few more days. It's right here, but with the new year, I'll have a new one. So $1.55 for these, I love these. $1.55 for one or a couple of dollars, you get a big pack, which is what I have next but I have two different types I will be doing first and then I'll be going back to these and my last item is my Nivea lotion for $5.79 it works great it's very moisturizing but it's not scented and I guess that matters to me so the next one I have is coconut after that I might be going to something else but the water activated lotion really look it's really good and that's it. <laughs> my total for December is $52.51, which brings my year-long total to $1,164.82. That's awesome. I My goal was 1000 Way surpassed that. Next year, my goal is going to be $1,500. So we'll, sh we'll see you all next year. But... That's it, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.